All right, welcome everybody back to another exciting game of Backyard Baseball Season 4. We are on game number 8 today. Still undefeated, 7 wins, 0 losses, and today we are playing an away game against the Orioles. Not to be confused with the Oreos, that's a different team. I think that's a real team, but I, I don't know what state has the Orioles, so... Well, that'll, that'll be fun. Away game, hopefully it's a good field. Because if it's uh, if it's Tin Can Alley or Sandy Flats, we uh, we might be in for some trouble. So let's go to the roster. Fingers crossed, it's something good. Uh, it's Sandy Flats. All right, this is my personal least favorite course in the game, but we're gonna just have to deal with it. The sand makes everything slow. It's pretty much impossible to get home runs on this course because, as you can see, like look how far the field. You have to hit it all the way to the water to get a home run on this side. Although, if you hit it over this trash on this side, you can, can get a home run. But it's still very, very long distance. So we're probably not going to see any homers today. Although, if they hit it in way out here into the outfield, it's going to be a huge pain in the butt to get it back. So, oh boy. This is, is going to be rough. Let's see our team. Oh, no! What the heck? Pablo, no! Oh, my... Pablo went from being, like, my best player to, like... Oh, what the heck? He sucks! He's he's fast, and that's it? Wow! Jeez Louise, it looks like Pablo's suffering from the hurricane, too. Good lord! That is... That's real bad. That's real bad. I... That's not good. We better hope our other team has got some increases. Kenny's at least back to normal. Charlie Brown's fine. Pete's fine. Angela's fine. Kimmy's back to normal. Reese is normal. No! Marky got decreases too! Oh, this is horrible. At least I still got that speed, coach! Shut up, Marky. <laughs> well, great. This is awful. Annie better be stat Annie better be capped at everything. Nope, she's normal. Great. So my two best players are now absolute trash. Wonderful. All right, well, we're moving Pablo to the back of the batting lineup. And Marky's going right behind that. Uh, wow, this is not going to be good. Well, we got Marky and Pablo now at the back of the lineup. Pablo, I'm going to put at the end because at least he is... Actually, no, no, you know what? Pablo, we're going to have at the front, but he's going to be a bunter. Or he's going to hit grounders. With his speed, he will actually be enough to get reliably on. Angela's going to have to really pull her weight here for getting home runs. I'm going to actually put Kimmy right after her because she... No, wait. Nobody's getting a home run today. That's that's pretty much for sure. Marky's going to be at last. There. I think that, that... Kimmy and Angela are both slow, but... Hmm. Yeah. I think that's just going to have to do it for batting. This is real, real bad. I... Pobble... Okay, hang on a second. Pobble got a minus 16 today. He got 16 points decreased. And Marky got... <laughs> 9. That's 25 points that have been decreased for my team. And no increases. Their team also better have some decreases as well. Okay, their team, they've got Ahmed Khan, and he actually got an increase in pitching, but that's not going to really affect anything. Carl Ripken Jr., okay, he got some decreases. That's at least a relief. Angelique Harding has gotten increases, of course. Eric LeBeau, he's normal. Ryan Vanderhoek is, has an increase in pitching. Dominic has an increase in pitching. Serena has an increase in pitching. Amanda's fine. And Claris is fine. Okay, I see how it is. So I get all the decreases, and they get all the increases. Sure. That's not fair at all. Wow. Okay, this is going to be our toughest game, I do believe. Oh my gosh, and because it's freaking Sandy Flats, I'm not even sure if my speed strategy is even going to be good. Great. Also, we're going to have to take Pablo out of the outfield today because, uh... Actually... I wish I could see if he still has at least somewhat of a good arm because he's going to drop stuff. I just need him to be able to chuck it back infield. So I'm actually going to keep him in the outfield for now, but worst comes to worst, we might have to move him somewhere else. Yeah, the, the odds are not in our favor today, but 
we're still going to do our best, play our best, and hope we score out a win. But I'm not super optimistic at this point. Here goes. It's time for another game of the most exciting baseball around. Yeah, yeah. Along with Vinny the Gooch, welcoming you friends of the feather to another edition of Baseball Madness. Today we'll see a close matchup between the Crazy Farmers and the Baltimore Orioles. This has been quite an exciting season for these kids, and the playoffs are in sight. These kids should be very proud of their performance so far. They've played hard, and it's paid off. And now it's time for the action to begin. Let's hear you, Bomber fans. Everyone's still rooting for the Bombers, even though half my team is sick. Great. <laughs> Bombers versus the Orioles at Sandy Flats. And the game stacked against us. <sighs> Let's go. Let's play ball. All right, Pete. We're going to try hitting a grounder. And I got to really hope that their catcher today is not good. I got to hope that their catcher today does not have an arm. Because otherwise, I'm not sure if we're going to be able to score. Out. <laughs> If their catcher has a good arm, we might have to rely on getting double plays and using special bats if we want to score at all. Because half my team is slow, and we're not going to be able to get home runs today. Wow! That was a great hit, Pete. That was a great hit. We're going to have Pete steal, and then Pablo hit a grounder. That was not a strike. Oh, yes, their catcher has no arm. Actually, no, no. Their pitcher probably does. Yeah, their pitcher has a cannon. Okay, pitcher has a cannon, catcher is really bad. That's honestly fine. In that case, I think we're going to be bunting with Pablo. Normally don't do that, but he's a two at batting today, so we got to. Oh my jeez! Okay, their pitcher is crazy. Their pitcher is crazy. She must have a. She literally must be capped in uh, throwing speed. I don't always bunt with Pablo, but when I do, it's because he's really bad at batting due to stat fluctuation. We're not playing in a desert. We're playing on a beach. Shoot, Pablo, you gotta run. You gotta run. Okay. They're more worried about Pablo. And the, oh, that's right. In the sand, the ball doesn't bounce. So we got to remember that as well. Angela, I need you to get it into the outfield. That would be great. You guys in the outfield better move back. Let's go, Angela. Okay, you got the energy, but we got to aim in the right direction now. Ideally, we hit it to right field way past their fielders, and then Angela might even get a double out of that. But this could be dangerous. If she grounds it out, we actually might end up uh, having a double play. Okay, we heard the crack, but that's not going super far. Uh-oh. Yes, we knocked him out. Okay, Reese, you gotta run. Reese, you gotta run, man. Come on. Kimmy. Kimmy, you gotta deliver today. You gotta deliver. Just like Santa on December 24th. Kimmy's gotta hit it real far into the outfield because Angela is slow. So even if Pablo gets home, Kimmy needs to get the first and Angela needs to get the second in order for us to get a point. Just a bit outside. Oh no, if they walk Kimmy, I th if they walk Kimmy, then I think next up is Charlie Brown, and that's also going to be disastrous. <laughs> Not sure how often the AI just throws to a random base, more just like we don't want them to go one base further. It does seem kind of random, though. I actually don't really want them to walk Kimmy. Okay, we got a crack. Pablo, you may as well go home. 
Darn, that's not good. Because that was the strong part of our lineup. And they've got some power players today. Okay, well, she's a point. Okay, I need to actually remember who on their team is good at batting and not. Okay. Clarice, okay, she's kind of fast. So their good batters are Angelique, Ahmed, and LeBeau. Okay. Angelique, Ahmed, and LeBeau. I can remember that. Everybody in Twitch chat, by definition, has a brain. Otherwise, you wouldn't be able to log into Twitch chat. <laughs> Clarice. <laughs> cool, we got a juice box. That's great. That's so great. Uh-oh. Oh, no. She hit it to Pablo. Pablo. That's okay. Reese, I'd, I'd rather you throw Wimpy now rather than when it actually matters. Now this kid got Mm-hmm. Ahmed Khan, let's not let him get a home run. Let's also have him not hit to Pablo, ideally. Yeah, okay, well, oh, you've got to be... Is he getting a home run on this side of the field? And it bounced back in. Great! Well, that's not good. They get two points up right in the first inning. Yeah, we might be hosed. I was really hoping we could get a double play there. We couldn't. I might... <sighs> okay. Who's next up at bat after him? So this is Cal Jr. Next, it's Eric LeBeau. He's slow, but Eric's also really good at batting, so I don't like that. Stop fouling it! Just get struck out already. Come on! Okay, cool. Strike out. We struck out the pro. That's good. Alright, it's Eric. Slow ball. Okay. No, I want Kimmy grabbing this. Kimmy, thank you for having a good arm. Kimmy's actually coming clutch defense wise. All right, they scored two points right from the get go, and we are at my weak part of the lineup. This is not good. All right, Annie. Your sandals are actually appropriate for this stage, but I don't think they're gonna help your speed. All right, line drive past Tim. No, he just catches it. Great. All right, Charlie Brown. All right, Charlie Brown. Make us proud. Whoa! Now, see, that's exactly what I'm talking about. Okay, let's see what a kind of an arm they have. Wimpy arm, please, wimpy arm. Yes, Charlie Brown with the double. Akmai Khan has a pretty good arm though, so we're staying at second. Nice job, Chuck Brown. Kenny, I really need you to hit it towards the outfield. Because I don't think Charlie Brown will be able to sacrifice himself for you. Great. We can try. Nope, that actually did work. Alright, Marky, we're going to have to go power... Honestly? Tactical move, I'm not going to swing with Marky. We are in a precarious situation where we could end up with a double play. And I think it's going to be safer, especially if Marky's decreased batting stat, to just let them strike him out and Pete Wheeler can potentially get it to the outfield. So, just ta tactical decision. And if they want to walk Marky, they can. But I, re I cannot let them get a special bat. I cannot let them get a special bat. That will be game over, pretty much. See you next time around, kid. It's okay, Marky. We played good baseball. That's what we were here to do. All right, Pete. We're going to go power. Pete, what they did to us, I want you to do to them. And by that, I mean get a home run and get some points. If Pete gets a home run here, 
it'll be epic. That's not a home run. Oh, no, no, no. Don't catch that. <gasps> oh, thank goodness. Oh, thank goodness. Unfortunately, we're at another pre we're at another precarious problem. Ah, blows up. But at least there is no double play possibility now. So, even though he's a two at batting, we're gonna try going power with Pablo. Pablo, you still got that batting stat in you. I just know it. Actually, it might be the case of because he's a two at batting, he just can't make contact. Yikes. Also, if I just mistimed the clicking. Yeah, Pablo is minus 8 in batting and minus 8 in fielding today. He is very sick today. <laughs> it's a me, a Marky! Pablo, please, bases are loaded. Get one person home. This is this is so bad. I hate being in this situation. I have two good batters, Pete and uh, Angela, and that's literally it. And he's passable, but not good at batting. And I well, I guess Charlie Brown can occasionally pull off. Some cool, some clutch hits. Please be a ball. Please be a ball. Please walk, Pablo. Please walk, Pablo. Please. Please walk, Pablo. I beg you. Nope, got a swing. Maybe we can tire Hellerman out and make her get off the mound. Just don't replace her with the catcher. No! See you next time around, kid. The curse of the low contact stat. That was awful. I mean, Charlie Brown came in clutch, but still, still zero. That's real bad. I needed Pete to hit it far. There's no way Amanda has the same stamina as Mr. Clanky. Simply no way. Oh, that dump. Let him go. Let him go to first. He's slow. Let him go. Wow, a Angela, that was uncalled for. I've decided we need to get a special bat. Come on, Amanda, I'm literally, I'm literally throwing you a, a bone here. Come on. Oh, yes. Well, actually, this won't be a double play. Darn it. Okay. No double play that time, but maybe we'll get a double play with this batter. Okay, she's not good. Does Kenny have perfect stamina, too? I guess that makes sense if he's just wheeling his way through life, but... At this point, though, I have to get a special bat if I want a shot. So, I have I have to try and force a double play. Rats. I honestly kind of thought that it would knock Angela down and that he'd go to second, and then we could get him out. But no, they're playing. They're a smart team. I don't think we're gonna beat them. I know it's only the second inning, but we're going back to the weak part of my lineup, so I really don't see it happening. Darn it, he was slow as well. Oh, it, oh, the difficulty ramped up massively with this team. Not only is their team pretty good, it's the worst possible stage, and we got disgustingly big decreases on our best player. Alright, I Reese, you gotta get on base, and Angela's gotta, like, just smash it out of the park. Without a special bat, that's our only hope. We're going power with Reese! He's shown he can actually pull it off. That's not very powerful. Not very cheese money of you. Drop it. Yes! The first baseman's terrible, but he still got Reese out! <laughs> 
because of the stupid sand. You guide me out here. Better move back. All right, Angela. Target goes up. Cut to the plate. Then the Okay. That's probably an easy pop-up for them. Yep. This is gonna be a one-two for Yanin. And then it's gonna be another one-two for Yanin. And then it'll probably be another one. Unless Pete can do something good. Or if Chelly Brown can pull off a miracle again. I do I must be mistiming the swings for Kimmy, because she keeps whiffing it. And when she does make contact, it always fouls. There we go! That's what I'm talking about! Don't catch this. Come on, please. You've got to be kidding me. That was actually a good hit. It doesn't help that their team is actually playing smartly and doing everything in their power to avoid the double plays. I am not throwing the slow-mo. Not even to Clary Stalin. And I can't even force a double play this inning because the next two batters are both stacked. Nice. No, not out of play. Not out of play, Marky Rune. Marky, are you? Who's laughing at that? <laughs> You're off the team. <laughs> That was... that... <laughs> that was a circus moment. That was Pablo laughing. <laughs> Pablo's off the team! <laughs> and he's minus eight in batting. I mean, they didn't they didn't do anything as a result of that. It was just ridiculous. Oh, yes. Easy money for Kenny. Kenny! Come on, run. Oh my gosh, yes! They're stupid. Yes! They were stupid! <laughs> oh, that's exactly what we needed. I'm honestly hoping for Crazy Bunt. Bello, thank you so much for the sub! <laughs> I really appreciate it, and enjoy the good banana. Okay, we're getting Ahmed out. I don't care if it's harsh. I'm getting you freaking out. Oh, Mobius, thank you for gifting the sub. I did not say that. Oh, you've got to be kidding me. Ahmed was not even nearly this good when I had him on my team. Pete, no. This is embarrassing. Throw it back. Oh. Oh, please, yes. Charlie Brown, don't be a stupid. Yes! He was... He was... Yes, he was too greedy. Wow, that was rude, Vinny. Please be a crazy bunt. I will also take an undergrounder. Right to the first baseman. <gasps> yes, knock he knocked down. Okay, run, run, run. Run, run, run. <sighs> nice going, Annie. Yes. Yes, girl, yes. We're not- we're saving that. We are saving that until a point where we can reasonably at least tie up the game. Besides, Charlie Brown has proven he can get it into the outfield on his own. Don't aim for the shins. It's very rude. If you walk Charlie Brown, I will use the undergrounder with Kenny. Uh-oh. Okay, actually, stealing might have been a bad idea. Nope. Stealing was a very good idea. Okay, yes! Okay, their catcher and first baseman are both garbage. That is the one saving grace. We're going undergrounder with Kenny. We are not swinging at it unless we are certain it's a strike, though. There we go. No! Alright, Marky, we're going undergrounder. There we go. Please hit it way into the outfield, please. Yes! Ground rule double for Marky! That, actually, that's kind of bad. 
We get one point, but it would have been really nice if it just went into the outfield and they would have to run after it. At least we scored. At least we scored. Alright, it's Pete. Here's hoping we have another undergrounder. If we do amazing, that's going to help us get back into the lead. If not, we can always hope that Pete can hit it into the out, uh, outfield. I'm gonna hit a touch nope. Man. All right, then we got to hope Pete can hit power. I can't believe they cheesed me out of my, one of my undergrounders. Oh, what a rip! Wait, is that an actual freaking home run? Was that good? <laughs> what? It hit the piece of trash and it disintegrated. <laughs> Pete Wheeler, this is why you are team captain. Yes. <laughs> I could cry. That puts us back in the lead. Yes! <laughs> yes! Oh, I'm so happy about that. Alright, Pablo, let's hit the grounder. Oh, please get on base. Come on, you got no arm, right? Yes. Oh, we're getting on base! We get another special bat! <laughs> <laughs> What's it going to be? What's it going to be? Another undergrounder. I'll take it. We'll go power with Reese again. Why not? With all of Pablo's decreases, I am very grateful that he is still fast. If Pablo lost his speed too, then that would just be it. <laughs> I'm I'm keeping that in my pocket. It's a surprise tool that'll help us later. I'm starting to think that speed might be the best stat in the game. Oh, what a crack! Dane Reese. Oh, don't catch it. D don't be a. Oh man, they caught it. But that's okay. We got Angela up next. Padawan Angela is up next. Again, keeping that undergrounder probably for the last inning when we get back to our fast characters again. Too low. Actually, that's probably... Nope, that was... Uh, the hooks make it impossible to see where the ball's going to end up. Surely not. Surely not! May as well try, Pablo. They might drop it. Well, duh. Duh. Well, duh. Duh. Wow. That... How embarrassing. <laughs> Maybe we should use the undergrounder now. You know what? No, we're using the undergrounder now. I I am hesitant to use it on Kimmy because she whiffs it a lot, but... Darn you, you fouled it, Kimmy! Kimmy, did you waste our... You freaking wasted our one undergrounder. Oh, Kimmy. Well, I mean, Angela's no way in in heck getting it to second. Oh my gosh, why is he being stupid and going for... Why is he being stupid and going for... No! How did he make it first? <laughs> Darn it! That would have been so good. I thought for sure we were going to reach the base first. That was, that was on me. That was dumb of me. I should have had her run. I was afraid if I had her run, he would then throw it two second, and Angela would have gotten out. But that's okay. We, we got four points that inning. That put us in the lead. That's exactly what we needed. This is good.
Are you going to catch an AD? Wow! Nice job, Angela! I might agree with you on Ricky being better than Kimmy. I consider Kimmy to be like bottom two or three in the game. Ricky, I just consider bottom five. And again, my opinion of Ricky might change A by playing him in this version and B playing him again, because I haven't played with him in a while. I remember him being good at defense, but just like he was abysmal at offense because he's the worst batter in the game and super slow. <laughs> All right, Dominic. <laughs> oh, if we get Jorge back last next season, that'll make my day. That'll make up for us picking Ricky as well. There you go. We got him out. Way to shut them down. We're going into inning five, and we have twice their points. This is good. All right. Nice line drive. Annie. Drop it. Oh, okay. He can't drop everything. That that was solid. All right, Charlie Brown, you're doing great. Charlie Brown is really, really carrying this team right now. Double and a single. Oh, I would love Dimitri back as well. Dimitri and Jorge Dream Team. Okay, Charlie Brown, that was uh, that was disappointing. All right, Kawaguchi gain. Let's hit power, and it's going to go two inches. That's the Kenny special. Drop it, drop it. Okay, even he's not dropping that. <laughs> One, two, three inning. Real surprise. Actually, wait. Okay, Amanda at this point has got to be gassed beyond belief, right? And next up at bat... Oh, my... Okay, I'm not going to walk her. But I will throw a slow ball down the middle and see if she can... Okay, maybe that... Okay, maybe actually, she's better at batting there. Oh, look at how slow she is, though. Okay, no, 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 we are walking her. We are walking her. We can get a double play, because the next person up at bat is so bad at speed and batting. I'm actually greatly appreciative that they keep using Amanda for their whole pitching lineup. <laughs> and that she's very tired now. So, oh no, in the time that you threw all those balls, she got all her energy back. Are you kidding me? <laughs> okay. She's going on. Next lady is her identical twin, Serena DeMonte, who is really slow and bad at batting. So... One of the worst Arthur episodes? Oh, you did not see enough Arthur episodes. <laughs> that went on for 25 seasons and... Pr Are you serious? She's like a four at batting. Dog on it. I was not expecting that. I was expecting her to ground it out. Oh well, we get another opportunity. Ryan, I don't think, is that great either. It wasn't even that. It was literally like I would get mildly irritated at something and people would be like, <laughs> It's like, I'm not angry, I'm just annoyed. <laughs> oh, here we go. Yes, this is what we want. Okay. Okay, so help me if you don't get... Are you actually kidding me right now? Let's throw it to third. Let's see if we can bait them out. Come on! Come on! <laughs> Doggone it. It's not free. I cannot believe he got the first. Okay, now we drink the juice. Nice strikeout, Angela. Let's get out of the inning and finish this horrid game. <laughs> what am I doing using a line drive with Marky? I've got the power! Yeah, and they threw an, a ball of ice. You're trying to stub his toe so he can't run. <laughs> Look what I can do. <laughs> Yuck! Look at me juggle that bat. They finally swapped out their pitcher. <laughs> oh, that Dominic. <laughs> I have no idea how good Dominic's going to be. 
And the count is three and one. You want to walk the boy? That'd be pretty good. <laughs> the stretch and I'm going to hold out. Hold out for the, the walk. <laughs> if there's one thing Mark loves to do, it's walk. Without shoes, obviously. Darn it, Marky. You are off your... Oh, he does have a batting decrease today, so that's probably why. Oh, what a kit! Yes! Don't catch it, please. Darn! I wanted that zigzag power-up. All right, Pablo. It's two... Oh, wait, it's Pablo two outs. Oh, no, we're not getting on base. We're not getting on base. Uh-uh. But we can try. We're not giving up. We're not quitters. Darn it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. They put their pitcher on first. So she couldn't make... Why was she so far off of first base? If you're that slow. I can't believe Pablo got on. Maybe we can get just one more point. <laughs> And because Dominic threw a single zigzag, he's probably getting tired now already, too. I've got this game figured out. <laughs> Reese does have this game figured out. He just hits power. That's all he needs. Into the wind of fire. So yeah. junk! Back towards the outfield. Oh, no, not Ahmed. Uh -huh. Oh, yes! Oh, yes, it's Ahmed! <laughs> Solid play, Reese. Way to go. Now Ahmed's got a big old bruise on his forehead. Imagine if Angela gets a home run here. Imagine if Angela... Actually, if Angela got walked here, that would be terrible. Because then it's Kimmy. <laughs> and we all know Kimmy can't bat. Even though it's supposed to be her one redeeming characteristic. A chunk That... Angela, I ha-chunked for that? <laughs> okay, we can't we can't rest yet though. Yes, we're two points up, but they've got their best players up next. Well, what are you waiting for? <laughs> Alright, nice job, Angela, nice job. Marky, one out. We are two outs away from winning this horrible game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Like if Ahmed gets if Ahmed gets a home run and their pro gets a home run, it ties up the game and we go into overtime. And we're at the weak part of our lineup. All right, let's get him out with the slow ball. Yes! Two outs, one out away from victory! Oh, you didn't? That's a great episode. It continues Mr. Rappern's love for cake. I, I'd put that as, like, maybe top ten episodes, honestly. I love that one. It's great. <laughs> so many quotable lines from it. All right, Angela, this is easy. Get out. Get him out. Marky. There. Okay, Marky. You had to take a second there, but there we go. Oh, are you having cake? <laughs> We're definitely having cake after this game. For Vinny the Gooch, this is Sunny Day, wishing you all peace, harmony, and great baseball. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that game was intense. I true after that first inning, I truly thought we were not going to win. But oh my gosh, Pete Weaver breaking the laws of physics and the reality of the game itself to get a home run. That was too good. This is why we need Pete on our team every season. He's the best. <laughs> Man. That what a game. That was crazy. I, I Again, I hate that field, but oh my gosh, Pete Wheeler, you are my favorite. Always have been, always will be. My name's Pete Wheeler. I, uh, my dad says I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed, but I can run real good. Yeah, and you're good at batting. Let's be honest, that, that was really good. <laughs> All right, we are 8-0 undefeated. Rangers are also freaking 8-0. The Reds are not. They are. They lost. They're 7-1. Okay, it is official. The Rangers are our number one big competition. 
All right. So next up uh, on Monday, we will be facing off against the Angels at our home field of Ekman Acres. So that'll be nice. Kimmy will be a lot better. Oh, let's look at the league leaders. So Ahmed Khan, now most home runs. Well, actually, everyone in the top 10 has five home runs. So, hey, good job, I guess. Pete has the most hits with Ray, Tr Ray Tran's going down. He's going down. The Ray Tran thinks he's so great. He thinks he's so special. A freaking Ray is now most runs batted in. And he's on the Rangers. Oh, when we go up against the Rangers, Ray is going down. Uh, runs scored. Uh, Pete has second most. You better. How is that Sidney Weber this good? How? The game. What the heck? How is Sidney Weber doing this well? This defies all logic. Pete still is the highest. Oh no! Freaking Ray Tran now is tied with Pete for batting average. Oh, oh, he's he's my nemesis now. Ray Tran, you you going down? You going down? Oh, Ray Tran, you think you're so special because you're in the like the top three of every single category? Oh, yeah, well, Pete Wheeler has 12 steals. What do you what do you have to say to that, Ray Tran? What do you have to say to that? Angel's got 42 strikeouts. Are you even in the top 10 for strikeouts? Don't you have satellite TV? I didn't think so. Oh, oh, look at that. Angela has a, such a run percentage. Pete Wheeler with the most errors now? What? When did that happen? I thought Pete played really well today. I'm so, wait, how? I'm sorry. How does Pete have the most errors of six? Marky caused six errors solo, single-handedly today just trying to throw the ball to Angela repeatedly in one play. How? I don't. All right, then, I guess. <laughs> Big Play Ray is one of your former players. Oh, you love the dude? I don't recognize him. He's the one tomboy kid who's good at everything. Oh, no. Is he, like, capped at pretty much everything? He's terrible at defense. Well, we will uh, we will take advantage of that when we eventually go up against him, probably in the World Series with the way things are going. Not capped at all? Okay. Then he's going down. Well, Sidney Weber is also not anywhere close to being capped, but she's apparently doing just fine for herself. Don't really understand how or why, but there we go. Pete Wheeler is 100% MVP today. What the heck, dude? Like, that was nut. That was absolutely nutty, what he did. <laughs> Hitting the ball into a, like, a sailcloth, and then it, like, dissolves into water. I don't, I don't know what you did, Pete, but it tricked the refs into giving us points. So, good job. Good job, Pete. I don't... <laughs> you, you did it. You got your home run for the season, so that's amazing. Raytran has Charlie Brown stats if he was... <laughs> Wait, is he six at everything as well? <laughs> or is he, like, just, like... Oh, seven, eight, eight, one. Oh. Wait. So he's one better at batting than Charlie Brown, but he has, like, the highest batting average? What? This doesn't make sense. It's almost like the games aren't actually being played, and the the... The AI, the program is just being like, all right, we'll calculate random totals for these games. And yeah, we've decided Ray Tran's going to be the MVP of the season. He's going to get all of the points. <laughs> what? <laughs> that's not That's not how the force works. <laughs> all right, well, that was Backyard Baseball Game 8. That was a very insane game, but a, definitely a memorable one. That, <laughs> that one will be a lot more memorable than the previous game we played, so I hope you all enjoyed that. Uh, that was, yeah. I, I will remember that one, and I'm very happy that we continued our win streak.